What's up guys, for Complex Hustle, I'm Kylie Marr. Your favorite celebrities who you follow for style inspiration? There are hidden figures behind their stees. Even celebs who are fashion designers themselves still get a little help sometimes, mainly because they just don't have the time to go shopping and, well, because they can. Now, with the help of social media, primarily Instagram, some stylists have become celebrities on their own, like my personal favorite, Monica Rose, who is the fashion guru behind stylish celebs Chrissy Teigen and the Kardashians. I know, love them or hate them, but you can't deny that the Kardashians are known for being trendsetters. Although styling for A-list celebrities could be a lucrative business, there are other outlets in the fashion industry where stylists hustle, like fashion editorials for magazines and ad campaigns. But like any other job related to the entertainment industry, it's just not easy to break into the biz. So how do you get into the business and succeed? We've got tips from three of the best high-profile stylists today. Sean Melson, known for styling Gucci Mane, focuses on improving more than her clients' style, but also their lives and careers, and takes pride in her outstanding customer service. Stay consistent and always work like it's the first day on the job. Go the extra mile. Don't give clients what they want. Give them what they don't know they want yet. And never be a yes person. Be honest with your clients because when they look bad, you look bad. Diane Garcia, known for curating the looks of Kendrick Lamar, Schoolboy Q, and Chance the Rapper, got her start working as a production assistant on a Carrie Hilson music video. Garcia believes that there are specific skills that are necessary to succeed as a stylist. Build your credit, be good at accounting, master negotiating, stay organized, be kind, be genuine, make real connections, listen to your intuition, have good people skills, and don't date your colleagues. Anybody can have an eye for style and know the latest brands, but being able to sell yourself as a business and maintain it takes another level of skill that no school will teach you. And last but not least, my fave, Monica Rose. Rose is a self-made entrepreneur behind many of today's top trendsetters. Here is her advice to aspiring stylists. It's all about timing, so be patient, work your ass off, and never give up. Always follow your intuition, and if something is off or you're not feeling good about the situation, it's most likely not the right job. Rose also stated, Be fearless. Never let your fear set you back. Surround yourself with positive people in your life who support you and believe in you. Be honest and loyal. It will take you far in this business, so be sure not to burn any bridges. Be hungry, not thirsty. It's important to note that this great advice isn't just for aspiring stylists. These career tips can be applied to any job out there for all young entrepreneurs. If you're a good person, you work hard and are tenacious, then you can succeed too. For more entrepreneurial stories and hustle advice, keep it locked on Complex Hustle by subscribing to our channel on YouTube. For Complex Hustle, I'm Kylie Marr.